welcome back. The Rough Rider Inc. and Iron Expo at Shows Arena this weekend continues with people of all ages taking the opportunity to get tatted up. Valley News Team's Natalie Parsons explains how the ink scene has changed. Some say it's the buzzing sound or how it makes them feel. It doesn't matter how small or large that tattoo may be, because once you're inked, you're hooked. It's just something I rather enjoyed. I've always been a fan of the art and the style of it. There's no standard for who or why a person gets one, but all tattoo lovers can agree on one thing. Wear it out there in the world to see. It tells a story, starts a conversation, and I think it brings people closer together. Some do it for beauty reasons, to make the task of putting on makeup easier, or to erase the scars of a painful yesterday battling breast cancer to help bring on a brighter tomorrow. The meaning of a lotus where it grows out of the mud and the muck and it will just be beautiful and I just wanted to, something to represent that I'm cancer free. More and more people are joining this club as the stigma of tattoos in the workplace looks to be a thing of the past. People would just get quiet. Everybody in line like, oh my God. There's a horrible person here. We better watch our backs. But now it's like everybody has tattoos. And maybe in the future, it's going to be kind of weird if you don't have one. No matter what the reason, it's not always black and white living in this sea of color. Natalie Parsons, Valley News Live. You have one more day to check out the Rough Rider Ink and Iron Expo at Shows Arena in Fargo. And to find out which tattoo artists are there and about the motorcycle side of it, head over to valleynewslive.com. So, what do we have for sports? I, oh. I haven't seen you all week. Cause there, is, there was uh, something that happened today out in Macomb, Illinois, okay. and uh, we'll tell you about that. We'll spend a lot of time talking about that. Plus, North Dakota football going for six in a row. We got highlights from them in Pocatello next in sports.